Hello, 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 my love bugs. Once again, it's your girl, Lumi Love, here with another message from the divine. As I always say today, if you're hearing my voice, I ask that you harden not your heart, for I'm just a messenger, and we are all here to witness and learn. Thank you guys for your likes, subscribe, shares, and views. Everything's greatly appreciated, my loves. Ooh, let's go ahead and get into it, all right? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's let's get it. I keep hearing the same song. I'm hearing 25 lighters on my dresser. Yes, sir. I got to get paid. But I'm hearing the part. He was like, I got 25 something, 25. Um, uh, about to break down with about 25 hoes. And then I heard, uh, where them haters at? Where them haters at? Man, for real. I don't know. Like, I'm just hearing it. Like, I guess that's how this person feel. This person feel like they got a lot of haters because they maybe ended something. So, the people they ended stuff with is in this pile, and whoever they balancing out with is in this pile, okay? So, um, this person is having a lot of endings now. Maybe that's how they was in the beginning. They had a lot of hoes. They had a lot of money. They had a lot of, you know, movement, and now this person is trying... <laughs> now this person is trying to escape a love relationship with somebody else. Maybe they're trying to escape these endings and come whoa i'm hearing escape these idiots and come make love to you they feel like they're thinking rationally now and they want to call a truce this person is trying their hardest to make their way to you i don't know why i had to go through the whole houston thing the whole texas you know song it was an emphasis on the texas and being able to move so maybe this person is from texas maybe this person was in texas this person is damn show fixated <laughs> <laughs> Look at their face. He is fixated and Dale show coming towards you, okay? These endings is pushing him towards you. He's trying to escape this karma. And in your energy, he'll be able to sustain it, okay? Now, he's having cool karma with, uh... Damn, he having karma with a queen of... Uh, okay, he could be having karma with the baby mama of his or having karma with the wife of his. Um, and he's disgusted by the relationship. That's why he feels like he's thinking rationally now and he wants to come level up and be your man. I'm hearing, I want to be your man. I want to be your man, baby. Mm. Won't you tell you why? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I can't live. <laughs> He said he can't live his life without you, okay? You are his world. You are my everything. <laughs> this person feels like he cannot stand it. This person is crazy. They're trying to attribute their feelings to you. I really feel like, yeah, this is something that this Queen of Cups used to manipulate this masculine because he is too old. He's, he's really pushing it. He's forcing it. He's, 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 yeah, just because he had some sort of epiphany, I guess since he lost his money, lost his stability, I guess he really felt like matching up with this woman, he was going to be able to get whatever it, it was that he wanted, and it didn't work that way. Yeah, you used to be in a relationship with this person, maybe, you know, you gave this, this person a, I'm here giving you the best that I got, okay, so maybe at one point you were giving this person the best that you had and this person shitted on you and when it got married to somebody else i mean plain and simple period there was nothing in between i guess this person found out that you really had some feelings for them and they just cut your ass off and went off and got married to somebody else i guess they already knew you know they were keeping you in a third party you didn't know this person got married behind your back too mm -hmm. gave somebody else this ring because they thought it was going to lead them to wealth and now they have nothing but sorrow because they ain't got a damn thing left like this person is spying on you i'm telling you this person is spying on you i don't know if they're crying they have someone's crying but this person is spying on you and this person is obsessed with getting justice with you they're working very very hard yeah they got somebody crying you i'm hearing payroll they got somebody on the payroll to watch you god dog yes they got somebody on the payroll to watch you this person is paying for you to be watched this is crazy because they want to change their fate. I'm telling you, this person's obsessed. Now, you remember how I laughed and I showed you the dude that was on the chariot with the two horses? The two horses is the people doing the damn magic for this man. Two people right over here. And they might be feminine energies trying to help this masculine drag you in. I'm hearing drag you in, put you under some sort of illusion and make you come towards him so that he can receive from you and get success and be able to go pass his money out with other people. This person wants your money to trick with other feminines. This person wants you. This person <laughs> this person wants your pocketbook so he can trick 
Okay, 25 lighters of him dress about 25 hoes. I guess he did. And the fact that he don't have no more money, he can't handle them hoes. I'm thinking about that song. Okay, meanwhile, you living good. King, queen of swords. Okay, you're the one that's actually thinking rationally, moving correctly. Yes, also moving with swiftness. This got this person disappointed. Got a lot of people disappointed. And also these people he had on the payroll, they're worried because now he don't have no money. He's not getting the opportunity they promised him he would get. And he's not paying them anymore, okay? Now he's going to try it himself and come towards you because it wasn't working with them. He wants to reconcile because your life is great. You're in a higher energy. Everything's going great for you. Uh, even when people try to attack you, you still come out on top. You stand your ground. Okay? You do not accept defeat. And that's what defeats the other person. You use your intuition every time. You are on point, my love. All right? This person's upset because they can't trick you into loving them, wanting to deal with them, wanting to lay with them. Whatever magic that they were trying to do, that just love magic that they were trying to do, it's not working. No, it's not working. You're having happiness elsewhere. And this person wanted to be in control of that, okay? Yeah, that's why they invested so much into the situation because they wanted to be the ones to get the victory over you so that you would hang yourself. But again, they, okay, so did you do hang yourself? They lied to whoever this is that was trying to cause an illusion, okay? You're in too high vi vibration to get this karmic energy. Plus, you always know that somebody's going to try to attack you. Somebody's trying to sabotage you in order to change your judgment to gain money from you. Because they all see you out here looking good. They want to interfere and get you caught back in your head. It's kind of a reoccurring theme with people with you. You know what I'm saying? So, you're sitting in your own success. And you're not worried about anything that's going on in the outside. Because I feel like you're protected. You know you have a circle of protection around you. Yeah, you got a circle of protection around you. You are in the divine energy, okay? And that's why you're receiving... Um, you're receiving your just due. You're receiving money. You're enterprising. You're moving forward. And you're going to be able to provide for those that you love for. That's the only reason why this person wants to get back in your energy. Because they know that you're going to provide for those that you love. So they want to get back into your loving energy. They want to call a truce. They want peace. All right. This person also wants to lay with you. This person wants to have sex with you. Obviously, that's why they're sending you sex magic. Um, I mean, love magic. Um, and, you know, you totally have your guard up to all that. You don't want none of that. Um, you're getting good news elsewhere by working with another person. All right. Uh, yeah. And this person's just looking at you now, maybe saying that in the past, you know, you look good now. You, you just know this person is trying to gaslight you. You don't give a damn about that. Like I said, you're matching up with someone else. You're getting good news with someone else courting you. All right. And that's the truth. And this person is oppressed by that idea. They're having so much. That's why they're coming towards you with so much like so much passion okay and they're trying to have forward movement with you not only because you're being successful by yourself but you're about to be successful with someone else and they want to come in and change your fate i guess this person was doing love magic and they wanted to come up close and get a close-up on why the hell is this not working why the hell am i not being able to hold them back it's something else that's holding me back and they's finding out that you have another masculine in your energy that is protecting you okay and they want you to walk away from that come love on them but again you're in a higher vibration and you don't want to deal with this person you don't want to go back to whatever it was in the past that this person wants you to deal with i gotta get a couple cards out of here and then i actually have to pull out of the love deck sheesh sheesh i'm hearing ho ho sideline ho <laughs> what you a ho, use a ho, sideline ho. Okay, people can see that I'm jealous of you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm trying anything to hurt you. Your death is my money. I ghosted you for another. Listen. I'm feeling a feminine energy as well. This masculine trying to come to you and have success with you. But he had two different options of people he was giving to, and he snuck off to try to come deal with you. Or he's sneaking off to try to come deal with you. And this is the person that he ghosted you for. So this person is also trying to attack you, and they ride past your house often. They know where you stay because they think that they're going to... This is crazy. They think that they're going to catch this masculine outside of your home. I think this person may be following this masculine on GPS or whatever. GPS from his phone to see where he's at. Maybe that's why he... Oh, she said he got two phones. I'm here. I got two phones. One for the plug and one for the load. Okay, so this masculine has two phones. 
and uh he was running away from whoever this other person is sneaking off and i guess this woman went through his phone and found out that he was looking at you looking at your stuff following you <gasps> she found out he was tracking you bro he had some sort of tracker on your phone if you had the same number i'm hearing some of y'all recently maybe changed your number but if you had the same number this person was tracking you off of that phone I don't know. This person had you tracked on your phone some sort of way. Because he knew where you stayed. He knew what you was doing. He was watching you. He was trying to wait until a moment where he can come in and get you. But he couldn't find a moment to come in. And um, this feminine was looking through one of his phones. Because she know he got two phones. And she put around to find out that he was trying to come towards you. And baby, that woman has been on a rampage ever since. My goodness, my gracious, my God. <laughs> yes okay a spiritual std she's been trying to give you a spiritual std so you don't deal with this person put needles and pins maybe in your private area in the door to give you a spiritual std trying to bind this masculine to her because he wants a breakup of their partnership or a divorce she's sending monitoring spirits to watch over him see that monitoring spirit shit that's whatever app she using to track this man child is letting know where you stand now ain't that something he ain't got nothing to worry about though most definitely you're spiritually protected damn you're spiritually protected by this romance that you already in that's why you're so confident your confidence is what's helping push you forward because you're confident in this other relationship that you have or this other partnership that you know the, the holy spirit is gonna bring toward you so you don't care about nobody trying to get in your way you know people in secret trying to stop you and they disappointed because you ain't paying them no mind. Specifically this person. And you passed judgment on this person because you knew they was just trying to come in and take an opportunity from you anyway. So you ain't got nothing to worry about. This is just what's going on in the background with the crazy people. All right. <laughs> all right, y'all. This is it. This is all my loves. I'm going to close this one out. And, I, you know, I might have one more in me. I want to read on some love. I keep trying to avoid it. And I, I, I think that's what the person wants me to do. Because I keep wanting to pull on these love cards. So we're going to get some love in next because... <laughs> fuck the op all right let's go ahead and <laughs> let's go ahead and get into the next one y'all